6.30 in the morning and we're one of the lucky ones that don't have a sunrise. We're always the lucky ones. Yeah. That's what it looks like. It's windy up here. Very windy. You can see from your pants. I'm not even moving. <laughs> <laughs> It's pouring. It's really <laughs> coming down. Listen. We ran inside the tent. Just in time. Mm -hmm. We really, whatever we heard down that way that sounded like rain, I think really was the rain. And it came this way. And then we ran down the sand dunes <laughs> and into our tent because now it's pouring. Yeah. I sure hope this doesn't happen when we have to take like the half hour, 40 minute camel ride back because we don't have rain jackets. Mm -hmm. If that's the case, we'll ask for the, <laughs> we'll ask for the car. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. But I want to ride Charlie. Oh, she named her camel. She named her camel Charlie for CNC. CNC. Ices. Ices. Sahara Desert. This is <laughs> oh boy. But yeah, my camel's name is now Charlie, and he's so cute, and his head is so soft. Mm. <laughs> They're so cute, these camels. I love them. Oh boy. <laughs> Maybe we'll go back to bed until they wake us up. Maybe. Okay. We have to shower, but it's pouring. I don't want to go outside. Mm -hmm. I'll sleep. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Bye bye. Bye. What's up? What? 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 <laughs> oh my god. Hold on. No, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> he just fully rolled over. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> My camel rolled over. <laughs> Almost squished her. When I was getting off. <laughs> yeah, but it was the same thing. Like your camel was the one that was laying down. <laughs> Right, sure. 
saw it in an episode once uh, in a Canadian television show where you put a plastic oh well, you dig a hole put a plastic over it make like kind of a barrier with a cup under obviously and then you put a rock in the center of the plastic wait for the condensation of the water to come up and drop into your cup that was one way of getting water and and now we understand why that why and how that happens so which is really cool it's like mind blown moment right there <laughs> So those were the, uh, the tents that we, not those exact ones, but very similar. Those are the same tents that we stayed in last night. Um, those ho those uh, tents are actually owned by hotels in the main city and they sell um, stays or they sell nights for people to ride in their camels to get into these tents. So our tour um, took us to one of these hotels and they lent us their camels and led us to their set of tents. These are pants, smell like camel. Stinky camel. Stinky camel. <laughs> I have to wash these. We're here at the Mascara Mines. These mines were owned by the French, uh, but when they left the area, they decided to bomb the mines to make it really difficult for the Moroccan people to actually continue mining and make a living. But the government of Morocco has given, I guess, kind of some money to the local people to give them incentive to continue mining these areas. And so um, there are different lots what they call lines and they are owned by different families so each family has their own set of lines and that's where they mine um, for different rocks which either produce the powder for mascara, quartz, hematite among different other minerals and these these uh, minerals and rocks they're able to produce jewelry, mascara, um, we can find also some crystals in this area and they've also found a lot of fossils which um, indicate that this area was filled with water because there's a lot of animal or water animals that are found in these fossil rocks. So before they used to uh, create lines to create the um, to get all the minerals from the bottom but now how they do it is they create a hole all the way to where the minerals are get all the minerals that they need and then instead of creating another line to get all the stuff they don't want they'll create another hole next to it which you'll see over there dig get to the level that you need to and then just create a tunnel underneath and grab all the all the good stuff instead of digging huge lines of just wasting all the energy and effort um, of digging huge lines like how to do it before <laughs> so